Bet you've heard about Flat Earth, but you've never heard of Earth expansion. Bet you've heard about Pangaea, but you didn't know that Pangaea was simply the entirety of the planet's outer surface, without excess water. Mars, unlike the Earth, is devoid of water on its surface. There are no oceans or ice to obscure any of its true geological features. All aspects of what needs to be analyzed can be accounted for. Plate tectonics states that large-scale pieces of continental crust supposedly gets pushed around and slide and glide atop the magma below. Then these constantly moving continents smash into each other or spread apart over millions of years, inch by inch. But there is zero evidence of this on Mars. Even though Mars once had as much tectonic activity as Earth, allowing it to boast the largest volcano to have ever existed in the entirety of the solar system, Olympus Mons, which is three times as tall as Mount Everest. And Mars also possesses the largest rift valley, trench, or canyon to exist in the entirety of the solar system as well, Valles Marineris. Yet Mars somehow boasts no other rift valleys, subduction zones, or continental plate boundaries, lined by remnants of volcanoes or uplifted mountain ridges. The bare surface of this barren planet reveals all, as the entirety of the planet's outer surface is visible, but somehow there is no visible evidence of there ever being plate tectonics on Mars. So much so that Mars, much like our moon, possesses zero continents and zero continental boundaries.